Hello friends, I'm sharing an interesting case with few clinical tips of a mandibular first molar with distoproximal caries and pulpitis. We begin the endodontic treatment with a pre-endodontic buildup to ensure adequate isolation and a predictable outcome. Upon initial access, I could locate four canals, two in the mesial and two in the distal which are cleaned and shaped completely. And now we search for the extra canal. I could suspect a middle mesial canal as I can see an increased distance between the mesiobuccal and the mesiolingual and I can also see a catchy point felt with the DG16 and now I explore the area with the rotary orifice shaper and once I confirm the canal we complete the shaping and cleaning of the middle mesial canal as well and all the canals are then thoroughly irrigated with some active irrigation and now as I aspirate from the middle mesial canal I could see the irrigant disappearing mainly from the mesiobuccal canal which confirms the communication between them and this is confirmed when I place the sealer during the obturation as, I can, as you can see here I am placing the mesiobuccal I could see the middle mesial canal getting filled with the sealer whereas the mesiolingual canal is not getting filled which means it's an independent mesiolingual canal all the canals are obturated thoroughly with the bioceramic technique pulp chamber clean and then a composite entrance filling done. See you all soon in our next video.